Garrett Gormley photography has been a thing now for probably about four official years. Although I've been taking photos as a hobby for probably more towards seven or eight years. I went over to my friend's house when I was in middle school and their parents had an expensive camera. And I think that's what I remember is really the starting point of my interest in cameras and photography. So the next year my parents got me my first uh, DSLR for Christmas and that was the start of my hobby in photography. Uh, I do probably no less than 10 seniors a year and uh, being in college right now it uh, makes it a little bit difficult because I'm away for most of the year so in the summer I have to squeeze in all those seniors and uh, behind seniors it's probably uh, weddings, babies, uh, family photos, uh, just miscellaneous things like that, sports, all fall kind of, those are all kind of tied for a second in what I shoot. For portrait photos I place a really high value on depth of field so I, I think that what people really, really enjoy about photos that they might not know is depth of field. And when uh, a background is out of focus or a foreground is out of focus and your subject is in focus, I think that most people really, really enjoy that and they really like to look at that even though they might not really know what they enjoy about the photo. I place a really high value on having just my subject in focus for sports photos, for instance, I think the correct shutter speed is crucial um, without the correct shutter speed. Obviously, my, uh, my other settings have to be the right, in the right order for the shutter speed to be right, but uh, if you have the right shutter speed, then your photos won't be blurry, and for sports, that's basically the most important thing is sports photos can't be blurry. For wedding photos, I would say that the the first thing that comes to my mind is moments. So in a wedding, it, uh, everything's very chaotic and everything's happening very quickly. And I have to pay special attention to what the most important parts of the day are. And when I'm shooting a wedding, I have to be thinking about the day that I deliver the CD of photos to my clients and what they're gonna be expecting to see what photos they're going to be excited to see even before they put the CD in their computer. And I have to make sure that those photos on the day that I'm taking the wedding photos are the best ones and that they're taken in a unique way that my clients have never seen them taken before. When I picked up my first camera it was because I thought it was awesome and not lucrative. Uh, I, I enjoy photography because I have a passion for it and I really just enjoy taking photos and if I wasn't taking photos I, if I wasn't taking portraits professionally I would be taking photos of something else for fun I think that I have quickly and at an early age figure out how to do that how to get the photos that they want to see on the day that I deliver their CD and uh, I think that uh, has fortunately already put me above my competition.